We present features, localization and sign distance function maps. This work is a collaboration between the Autonomous Systems Lab at ETH Zurich and the Microsoft Mixed Reality and AI Lab. Sign distance function representations have emerged as a leading representation for 3D reconstruction for their impressive ability to fuse noisy data at high rates. These images are from the seminal work Connect Fusion. However, to take sign distance functions to large scale environments has required different approaches. The map on the left is the product of our earlier work and is represented as a collection of submaps, which are shown on the right, where regions of the same color represent a submap. Under the hood, submaps are attached to a pose graph. Critical to operation in large scale environments is the ability to recognize when two submaps correspond to the same location. Existing approaches to geometry-based localization advocate extracting features on surface boundaries typically represented as point clouds. This paper aims to answer the question, can we use the sign distance function to improve methods for geometry-based localization? We illustrate our proposal on the Deutsches Museum dataset released with Google Cartographer. Here, we show a sign distance function based reconstruction from a backpack mounted LiDAR. Again, our map is represented as a collection of submaps. In this view, we have separated the submaps to illustrate our problem. To find submap pairs within the collection, which represent overlapping views of the world. Within each submap, geometry is represented as a sign distance function, visualized here in slices. Here are the slices for four submaps. We extract features at locations with high distance function curvature. Here, we visualize the curvature in free space using a colored point cloud. The yellow striations indicate regions of high curvature. The red spheres represent interest points. As an example, these can occur in regions of equal distance between objects. The curvature in these regions is high because the distance in one direction changes from increasing to decreasing. Here, we show curvature clouds from two submaps at the beginning and end of a trajectory. The red lines show corresponding features which led to a successful match. We show the versatility of our system by applying the same feature to matching fragments from the 3D match dataset after changing only a single scale dependent parameter. Lastly, we show results from our micro aerial vehicle, which is equipped with visual, inertial, and LiDAR sensing. In particular, we demonstrate the efficacy of our system for localizing a flying platform in a search and rescue training site. Here we show two maps built over two separate flights which partially overlap in the upper left hand corner. Note that the yellow map has been raised for clarity. Applying our method results in several successful localizations. Feature matches are shown here in green, which result in this final alignment. Thank you for watching.